Hey guys, this is Pastor Jonathan and this is 5 Minute Fridays. On every session of 5 Minute Fridays, we'll take a question, submit it in my Instagram question session on Wednesdays at Pastor John Vasquez, and we'll be answering that question a little more in depth. So if you want to get your question on 5 Minute Friday, all you got to do is submit your question on Instagram on Wednesday at Pastor John Vasquez, like I said before, and maybe your question will be on 5 Minute Friday. Today's question is, what advice would you give someone who is struggling with weight loss? For context, I have to tell you why this question was submitted. Those of you who know me um, know that I, I have recently lost a lot of weight. Um, as early as, or as recent as a year and a half ago, I was as heavy as 460 pounds. That is scary to even say, to be honest. Um, I was super heavy. I had totally fallen into this state of just not caring about what I was putting in my body. And um, I'm slightly embarrassed by it, but I hope that my transparency will help you uh, in this journey. Um, sincerely, when I started losing weight, I wasn't even trying to lose weight. Um, I was trying to support my wife, and in the process, I found the ability to lose weight and I was able to uh, lose a lot of weight quickly and that motivated me to go. Um, but I did also find some things inside of myself that helped me lose weight. So I wanna give you three tips if you're struggling with weight loss and obviously I don't pretend for a five minute video to be the end all be all of your weight loss journey. But if you're struggling with weight, here are three tips that I I would ask you to consider in your weight loss journey. Number one, know why you want this. Um, so many people go on weight loss journeys for different reasons. In fact, uh, media will promote that you should lose weight so that you have a bikini ready body in the summer or whatever. Um, there's so many reasons why people lose weight, but having the right reason is such a powerful motivator. Um, when I started losing weight, I realized that I wanted to do this for my wife, for my daughter, mostly for myself. I, I wanted to be here for a long time. I wanted to be able to see my daughter grow up, hopefully see more kids, working on that. And um, I wanted to see God fulfill all of the promises he had made me. So, you know, sticking through and losing weight and making sure I was healthy was important to my life so the right reason started to motivate me and whenever i couldn't find motivation i would just look at a picture of my daughter and my wife and that would push me forward so definitely figure out why you want to do this that's first first advice i can give you advice number two and this is a phrase that has become kind of like my life motto i guess uh, be intentional nothing happens by chance so if you want to lose weight, you have to be intentional about it. Make good choices. Decide this is what you want to do. Move forward. You know, make sure that you're taking steps to put yourself in a position where you're where you can lose weight. So be intentional about it. You know, if if you want to go to the gym, wake up early and do it. Schedule it, you know, so that you're forced to do it. Um like I said, you know, be focused on it and be intentional. Third, and this is a this is the important one for me, and I feel emotions coming already, so if I cry during this, I'm very sorry. If I don't cry, I'm sorry now, because I false advertised that I was gonna cry, and I, and I may not. Um, be forgiving of yourself. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna cry. I had gotten so bad that I was just resigned to the fact that I deserved to die for what I had done to my body. And the first thing I needed was to forgive myself for letting it get that far, forgive myself for, for allowing myself to get to the state where I didn't care. And um, if you struggle with weight, with appearance, with any of these things that cause insecurity, 
being forgiving of yourself is the hardest thing ever. So I, I highly encourage you, forgive yourself. Just the choices you made in the past or in the past, whatever choices you make from here on out are the ones that matter. And along the way, you're gonna make some bad choices. There will be days when you'll do things that you're not supposed to, and you have to be okay with saying, I made a mistake, let's move on. Forgiving yourself is the hardest thing to do, but you have to, because you'll never get to where you need to go until you can forgive where you're coming from. So, number one, know why you want this. Number two, be intentional. And number three, be forgiving of yourself. That's my advice to you. In this particular subject, because I feel so close to it, if you need any moral support or spiritual support or you want to know how I did this, please, please, please feel free to message me on my back channels, DM me, uh, either through Instagram, Facebook, here on YouTube. Um, my email will be listed at the bottom of this particular video. Uh, I want you to reach out to me if you feel disheartened because you're not seeing the results that you should. Um, so if you feel like you need it, please hit me up. I want to be there for you the way people were there for me. Um, if this video blessed your life, I ask you to please like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, share this video forward to someone who's in need. And, and please hit us up on our social media, Facebook and Instagram. Let us know if you enjoyed this. Uh, we hope that this is blessing your life. So I think I went over my five minutes, but I hope that whatever time you spent with me was worthwhile. So that's all I have for today. I'll see you next time on 5 Minute Friday. Thank you.